What's up guys, my name is Mr. Pixel and today we're gonna be looking at tea flip flops. So maybe you guys will be thinking that what's a tea flip flop? Tea flip flop is a circuit that gives a continuous output uh, to with a button. So in other words you can say that it turns a button into a lever but by saying in the lever by button. How oh, Let's crack on to the video. Alright guys, I have five designs for you. So we'll move from the left to the right. So let's see the first design. Alright guys, I have this design. This is a dropper hopper the flip flop and it's so tiny and it also works on Minecraft Pocket Edition. So you can build it. It's very tiny and compact. So let's hit the button so that's the lamp is turned off for now when we hit the button we will get a continuous output so it will be turned forever until we hit this button if we hit it again it turns off so let's move on to the design two all right guys this is the most common t flip flop this works by the piston mechanism so once again we hit the button we get a constant output in our lamp hit it again it turns on let's move on to our third design all right this is a pretty big but and expensive design but it's soundless so if you're building a hidden base or something like that this will be the design for you so when we hit the button the lamp turns off we hit it again gives us a constant output let's move on to design number three all right guys so if you are playing below the 1.10 version of minecraft you will this design won't work because this is the new observer block that was introduced in 1.10 so when we hit the button we get a constant output in the our lamp we hit it again, it turns off. Let's move on to the design number fifth. Alright guys, this design is a pretty small design but um, it's easy to build. But it gives two outputs so if there is any redstone here, this will whole mess. You understand that. So let's take it. When we hit the button, we get a constant output. When we hit it again, the lamp turns off. So, oh, okay guys, let's get into the building of it. Once again, we'll build from left to the right. Let's build all of these. Alright guys, you will need four into one space to build this design. And the materials that you will need are three droppers, one stone comparator, two blocks, a redstone lamp or anything that you need to connect, a button and one hopper. So let's get it. First of all, we'll place a dropper facing this way, facing this upwards. Then we'll, we'll place a, a dropper facing down and Finally, by crouching, we'll place this proper and place two of these blocks, a comparator, and this. Place any odd item in it. Oops, sorry, I forgot to mention you need a one item to put in this. Oh man, I don't know, I hate night. So, when we hit the button, it will turn on, hit it again it will turn off so let's design to build uh, let's get to building of the second design all right guys to build this we will need three by three area and uh two sticky piston one redstone block one redstone lamp a redstone dust two blocks of uh, your choice one button and one repeater first of all we'll place a block like this with a button on its face a redstone here and a uh, sticky piston facing this way and you may be wondering 
that why have I chosen the three iron blocks right there because the redstone doesn't work on the disc blocks uh, transparent blocks like stairs glass anything so I use this then the will place the sticky piston here and a block on its face with a repeater and the sticky piston facing this way with a redstone block and so, sorry for that a redstone lamp here so when we hit the button we get a constant output we will again it turns off all right guys to make the fifth third design we will need a uh, four into five area four into five then the materials that you will need are four redstone torch a redstone lamp five redstone five block of iron one button and four repeater so first of all we'll place a block here with a button on its face redstone torch here a repeater two blocks like this with a redstone here and another redstone torch two repeaters set to four ticks delays two redstone one block one torch redstone torch one redstone a button, redstone torch, a repeater here, and uh, the redstone dust here. So, and the redstone lamp on its face. So, this is the design. So, let's build. hit the button, the lamp turns up, hit it again, constant output. Nice. Let's move on to the fourth design all right guys to make this the fourth design we will need a uh, two by five area and the materials that you will be needing are one button one redstone lamp one observer two sticky pistons one block of redstone and one block so let's build it first of all we'll we'll place a block like this with a button on its face sticky piston here facing this way with an observer with the red dot facing the button this way then we'll place a sticky piston here and a redstone here and a redstone lamp here so when we hit the button we get a constant output we hit it again it turns off so let's move on to the last design all right guys for this last design we will need uh, a 2 by 4 area and a redstone block two sticky pistons uh, two redstone two redstone torch one button and two blocks of iron so let's make it first of all we will place our two pistons like this normal pistons not sticky normal distance like this or some block here or here i will place it here with uh, two blocks two redstone one redstone torch one redstone torch a button here oops i forgot the redstone lamp that's fine and a redstone lamp here or here so when we hit the button the redstone lamp turns off we hit it again it turns off all right guys thank you for watching guys i hope you enjoyed the video you learned some redstone from it and my name is mr pixel and i'll see you soon and forgot wait 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 uh, subscribe and like please bye bye